Welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to install Ubuntu Linux on Windows subsystem for Linux WSL on Windows 10. And again, how to install uh, OpenForm version 22.12 uh, on this uh, Ubuntu. So let's go ahead and uh, install it. First, I will use to I will use a uh, Microsoft Store to download the required Ubuntu. So click the Start and Store, okay. and the Microsoft Store will open. Microsoft Store, and you can find Ubuntu. And you can install actually this is uh half of my os is in japanese so it's here is 22.04 and if you inst click this is install button and if you click install it will automatically be uh, installed okay so i don't know which way to use because uh i i'm not sure i should use uh wsl2 or one now i'm currently using two so okay let's do it with this and it will take a lot of time i think to download and install ubuntu okay so now i've or uh, installed ubuntu 22.04 lts and this is open so i click open and i need to set up my uh account for the linux for this ubuntu linux and I will uh, need to ins uh, input insert my name and password. So now I need to input my name and password. Okay. I need to retype the password. Okay. I will now install um, Open Form twenty two twelve. And I will use uh, the documentation page for reference. And first, I will install the Ubuntu repository. So basically, all I need is to just copy and paste, and just uh, type your. Uh, Password and ask in this order, and it will be fine. It will take some time, but finally, it would work. So, the repository is set up, and I will okay. Fish 22 default. And it will install a lot of uh, packages. It's a super long list. And, yeah, and it will ask you want to continue. And yes. And it says uh, it needs to download 20, 221 megabytes and take like 1 gigabyte of my disk space. And it's fine. Just type Y and enter. And it will download uh, the required uh, packages and install Ubuntu finally. So everything is downloaded and installed. And I need to check whether an open form is in properly installed. So I'm not sure where is it now. It's uh, in user local. User mid. Mm, yeah, it's in user lib and here we go. We have our open form files in this uh, directory. So we need to uh, activate open form uh, so that we can use this open form uh, every time we open this. Um, uh, Linux uh, Ubuntu terminal 
And to do this, we need to source our bash RC of, of open form, which is located in uh, this etc file, etc directory. So I will go to etc directory. We can see this is our bash RC, which by sourcing this bash RC, we can activate open form. So it's like source our bash RC. It will take us a little bit, a few seconds, and it will work. Okay, now we can check whether our open form is good by block mesh. Okay, not help us maybe. Okay, now it's working. So you can see our block mesh, and it's working. So to permanently source this, we need to remember this. Uh, directory and copy this and we need to use bin now oops 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 Now I will set my source the dark okay and use our lib open form open form to twelve etc bash rc and go back close your uh Linux once and you open it once again and so 22.04 LTS. This is my new version. Okay. Now it's started and we can check again. Block mesh. Now it's running. Our open form 22 12 is up and running. So if we want to uh, run the tutorials, so let's test our, our open form tutorials. So we need to copy the tutorials first. CPS copy minus R. The source is from tutorials to here. We we make our form run. Then we will move. Copy the tutorials from tutorials to run. It'll take a few sec a few minutes probably because there the there are a lot of files in the tutorials. And after that we will run. Okay, it's finished. So we will go to the form run directory. Okay, now this is our actual uh, path. See tutorials. See tutorials. Compressible. I go form. Copy. Need another cut. So I will. Run. This is like the hello world for open form. Okay, it works, and we will run. I call, and it runs. See, there's uh five results files, and we can even uh see the results in Paraview. Okay. And that's it for installing Ubuntu and open form in Windows 10. Thank you very much and please stay in tune for other more detailed videos about open form and linux thank you very much